Hello beautiful people, it's Nita and today we are discussing the 10 things that you need in your wardrobe to make your fall wardrobe pop girl. Yes, we're talking about fall essentials today. Now before I get into the video, I have to say thank you guys so, 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 so much for your support, for voting and sharing. If you didn't know, I did win Fashion Haul Influencer of the Year for 2021. I am so excited. I am speechless. Um, and I'm really just honored, you guys. I appreciate your support. I appreciate your voting and your sharing because it is because of you guys that I've been blessed. Even just to be nominated was a blessing, but to win was just a huge milestone, accomplishment. I'm just really speechless and overjoyed. Thank you guys so, 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 so much for your support, for voting, for sharing, and all that you guys do. Um, I cannot say thank you enough. I say this in every video, but I truly mean it. I appreciate your support more than you know. All right, so back to the wardrobe essentials. So yes, in today's video, we're gonna be sharing the 10 fall wardrobe essentials that you need to make your wardrobe pop in the fall. So first up, we're gonna start off by talking about accessories, which is my personal favorite part of getting dressed. So first up, we are going to talk about tights, which is the number one fall essential in my personal opinion. Now, I love tights in the fall, and I think they're essential because they're the best way to transition your fall, I'm sorry, your summer and spring pieces into the fall. I love wearing tights with shorts, with dresses, with skirts, anything that's a little bit too short or especially in the evening when it's pretty cool, you can throw some tights on and some boots and you're pretty much good to go. I am wearing tights today with these faux leather shorts and I typically wear tights again all fall under my shorts. It's my favorite way to wear shorts with uh, tights and boots. So this portion of today's video is sponsored by Sheer Text. You guys, let's talk about this. So um, the only issue, one of the biggest issues that I actually have when I wear tights is the fact that I do like to wear stiletto nails, okay? So I always have an issue with my tights running or with poking holes in my tights or somehow with me wearing them throughout the evening, they end up with a run. And that's so tacky to be out somewhere and you got a big old run in your tights, okay? Now Sheer Text, they claim to be the world's strongest tights, okay? Now, I'm not gonna lie, you guys, when I discovered these, I was like, mm, strong tights? I don't really know about that. But, you guys, I did go ahead and put these tights to the test, and I can tell you that they are pretty good. Excuse my language, okay? So, as you can see here, I will go ahead and insert the video where I put them on. I did not put them on carefully. I actually put them on like I would put on jeans. And then afterwards, I needed to pull them up. So I did go ahead and use my nails to pull the tights up. And you guys, they did not rip. They did not tear. They did not snag. These are some good tights and you need them. Now, another thing that I love about these tights is the thick waistband. Now, I'll never forget a couple of years ago, I wore some tights with a dress for New Year's Eve. And you guys, the tights kept sliding down all night. That was so annoying for me to have to keep trying to shimmy in these um, tights up. The only saving grace is that I had them on with, it was a blazer dress and it had shorts. So that was the only saving grace for those tights. The only reason that they were not around my ankles because I would have taken them off. But y'all, that was so annoying. Now, what I love about these tights is that they have a thick waistband. So they literally don't move. Like, um, I put them on, I put them to the test, I wore them around the house, I put up some groceries because I got a grocery delivery. These tights literally have not budged. And I didn't have on shorts at the time. I put them on and I put a robe on. Um, and the tights have not moved or budged. Okay, this is about four hours ago. So I say all of that to say, I highly recommend these tights. I definitely think you will get your money's worth. Also, I don't know if I mentioned, they do have a 90 day, no snag, no rip, no tear guarantee, okay? Highly recommend these tights. Definitely check the description box below and use my discount code to save on your purchase from Sheer Tags, okay? Also, before I go, I'm gonna share another pair that I did get with you guys. So the pair that I'm wearing do, does have a, um, a seam up the back, but they also have this pair of um, slimming, um, tights okay now this does give a little bit of control up top the ones that I'm wearing currently with the seam up the back they don't have control but they do have that thick band that keeps it in place but these also these have um, a little bit of support and tummy control so I would also recommend these for the fall if you're wanting to wear some tights you're not trying to wear like Spanx you need a little extra support I think these would be a great option for you guys so definitely again check them out and use my discount code to save on your sheer text purchase all right, you guys, so continuing on to talk about accessories. Um, I don't know if you consider shoes an accessory, I do, but I definitely feel like everyone needs a pair of fun and cute sneakers, okay? 
Now, you guys, I'm a heel girl. I'm not into Jordans and stuff like that. I literally love cute sneakers, and I do not really wear tennis shoes in the uh, summer and fall, um, the summer and spring unless it's necessary, like if it's raining or something. Otherwise, I like sandals. I like my toes out. All that. So, in the fall, in um, in the fall, I love to wear cute sneakers. They have a fun print. These I got from Steve Madden about maybe two years ago i think they still sell them but if not steve madden always has cute uh comfortable sneakers but this pair i probably wear literally the most because they're cheetah and they're neutral they go with so many things i wear the heck out of these you guys um but i think that these are great because you can wear them with joggers um which is my uniform in the fall um you can wear them with jeans and you know you can wear these with a wide variety of things but i love pairing comfortable but yet cute tennis shoes with my outfits so just give it a little extra something especially when you want to be cute and casual so love these and i highly recommend any kind of fun cute sneaker now keeping in line with accessories i think that boots again i don't know if you consider shoes an accessory or not but boots are an essential that you need for the fall okay I like these slouchy boots because I think they're easy to put on and no matter whether if you have a wide calf or a wide foot or not, everyone can wear slouchy boots. So I did get these from Express last year and I've worn the heck out of them so I need to get a new pair. Um, I'll try to link them down below for you guys if I can find them but if not, you can literally find these everywhere. And again, I say slouchy boots but any kind of boots are essential for the fall because girl, it's cold and who doesn't love a good boot, okay? But um, yeah. I just said the slouchy boots because again, no matter how wide or narrow your calf is, pretty much anyone can get into a slouchy boot. So I think these are essential. So another accessory that I feel like you need for fall, and it's part my personal favorite, is hats. You guys, I love wearing hats in the fall. These are my two most worn hats, and it's just this black plain um, hat. And it's, uh, I would consider this kind of a wide brim hat. Fedora style hats are great too. And then this hat that I actually got from Amazon, I get a lot of compliments on it because it has the red underneath. But I wear this hat a lot too. I have all different colors of these hats, but in the fall, I literally reach for these hats at least three to four times a week. If I didn't have this bun, I probably have on a hat today. Now you might be saying, girl, you can wear these hats year round, which you can. However, I live in Texas and in the summer, it is too daggone hot for a hat. You will sweat your head off, okay? <laughs> so in the fall, I definitely go ahead and pull my hats out and I will wear them at least three to four times a week. Now I love these types of hats because I feel like it can take the most basic plain outfit and make it look instantly chic or give it a little interest especially if you do a hat with like a print or if you had a feather like I just feel like these hats especially in the fall just instantly make you look chic no matter what you have on jeans and a t-shirt throw on a hat girl it instantly just takes your whole look up a notch so I definitely think these are essential for the fall get you some hats or if you're not a hat girl try one out let me know if you're a hat girl in the comments below all right you guys so now we're going to get into the actual clothing pieces so the first clothing piece i'm going to talk about is again my absolute favorite for the fall and it is joggers you guys i literally live in joggers in the fall they're comfortable they're cute i wear joggers with tennis shoes i wear joggers with heels I wear joggers, like I just wear the heck out of them, okay? I just feel like you can't go wrong. <laughs> so this is the number one clothing essential piece, in my opinion, that you need in your wardrobe. Again, I wear these running errands with a t-shirt and my cute tennis shoes that I was telling you guys about. You can do a moto jacket, you can do a cute trench, you can put on one of those hats. And then I also wear them with heels and a cute, now I always do, if I do um, joggers with heels, I always typically do a trench, a cute bodysuit, and you can still do your hat, girl, listen. Put a trench, girl, listen. It's a vibe, it's a look, and you're comfortable. It's something about being cozy and comfortable in the fall that makes my heart happy. <laughs> Sorry about that, but yes, um, I literally live in joggers and they are just the, the definition of cute, comfy, and cozy. Dress them up, dress them down. I feel like everyone needs a good pair of joggers. Not a good pair, a few good pair, and you need a few different colors. So I'll link my favorites down below. <laughs> Now, the next essential, if you're not new to the channel, you already know how much I love and live for faux leather, okay? Now, as you can see, I have faux leather joggers because I told y'all I live in love for joggers, <laughs> but faux leather anything. You guys, this is the most chic outfit you can piece together. Faux leather instantly makes something look chic. It makes something look nice. 
I love faux leather. Leather as well, but I just say faux leather because it's a little bit more accessible at all price points. So um, again, these are faux leather joggers. I got these, I think from H&M. Actually, no, I got these from Target. I did pick these up last year, um, but again, I'll link what I can find down below, but faux leather period. Doesn't have to be faux leather joggers if you're not into joggers. Um, I actually have a pair of faux leather pants here that I got from Nordstrom Rack last year. Has a tag still on them because I got them like when it was starting to warm up. So I think I paid maybe $20 for these. But I love, love, love faux leather. You guys know how I feel about it. I will wear faux leather literally anything. Top, shorts, jeans, jackets. Girl, it doesn't even matter. I am a leather and faux leather girl. And I think that it is essential for the fall because, girl, it, it you're just going to give all the looks in faux leather. Period. <laughs> All right, babe, so the next fall essential that literally every woman needs, no matter how you like to dress, casual, dressy, chic, sporty, doesn't matter. Everyone needs a good pair of denim, okay? Now, you guys know I love and live for Express Jeans. They're my favorite brand so far. They fit me just right. I just love Express Jeans. Um, this particular pair, I think I've had these for... I know I've had these for probably about two years. Um, but yeah, I love Express Denim. But again, whatever brand you love, whatever brand works for you, it doesn't matter. You just need a good pair of jeans that hug you just right. And that make you look good and feel good more than anything. Comfortable jeans. You don't want something that makes you feel restricted or just that you don't think you look great in. So I highly encourage you, if you don't have your favorite jean brand, definitely try to find some jeans that work for you, that make you feel good and look good. Because jeans are an essential literally for every woman. doesn't matter how you like to dress dress up down casual sporty dressy chic doesn't matter everyone needs a good pair of jeans this will take you so far in your wardrobe i mean jeans and a t-shirt jeans and a button down jeans and a sweater jeans and a bodysuit it, it doesn't matter jeans and a crop top it doesn't matter jeans will take you so far and you need a good pair all right, babe, so the next thing that I believe is a fall wardrobe essential is beautiful sweater dresses. Like, oh my gosh. So I love dresses in general because I feel like it's just a one piece outfit. You don't have to worry about what are you gonna wear with it, unless you're gonna throw on a jacket and your accessories, but the dress is the outfit. You don't have to worry what pants you're gonna wear, what top you're gonna wear. This is it. This is the piece. <laughs> so I love dresses for that reason. And sweater dresses, especially a nice, good, cozy sweater dress, is right up my alley. Um, This one is from Express. I've had this for about two years. But I do my personal, my newest favorite sweater dress, I actually got from Amazon. Um, I don't think I've featured it in a video just yet, but I will show a picture here. I love this sweater dress, you guys. I will have it linked down for you guys below. Y'all fell in love with it on Instagram and when I shared it in my Amazon Live. If you haven't already, you should follow me on my Amazon storefront to be notified when I go live. But yeah, I love sweater dresses and I think that they're an essential for all of our wardrobes. You can dress them down. You can put on some flats or some loafers. You can dress them up with a heel, with a booty. You can do a flat boot. You can do um, stockings and pumps. You can throw a moto jacket over it. You can throw a trench over it. I mean, you can do so much with different types of sweater dresses. And I just think they're an essential for anyone's wardrobe. And again, I love dresses in general because it's a one-piece outfit. And you don't really have to put a lot of thought into the outfit. Now you can just accessorize and you're out the door. All right, babe. So the next fall wardrobe essential is a nice blazer. Now, I did get this blazer from Express, I uh, believe last year, maybe year before last. As you can see, the tag is still on it because I did not get a chance. Or did I wear this? I actually don't think I've had a chance to wear this cream blazer, but you guys, I love this blazer with the gold detailing. Now, they typically bring this style of blazer out every year just in different colors. I know for sure Zara does this every year. Um, I've seen blazers like this at H&M as well. Um, JCPenney also has some blazers like this I know last fall. So um, definitely check out those places for some blazers if you're interested or you're looking for blazers. But I definitely feel like blazers are a nice way to chic up any outfit. Well, I mean, when you wear a blazer, don't you just feel like a boss? Like it literally just makes any outfit bossy, chic, you know, just makes you feel like you got a little extra oomph, a little pep in, pep in your step, you know? And so I love blazers um, in the fall. Now, this is another piece that a lot of people feel like is year round. But again, I live in Texas. It is too hot in the summer and spring to wear a blazer. So the fall is where I flourish with them, okay? So I definitely feel like it's a wardrobe essential. Throw it on over jeans and a t-shirt. Throw it on over a dress. I mean, blazers, it's just, you need it, okay? <laughs> 
right, babe, so keeping in line with us talking about outerwear, the next fall wardrobe essential that you need is a good trench coat, okay? Now, I have these in almost every color now. I'm working on having every color because I love them so much. I throw them on literally with anything. Again, sweat. Um, I love pairing it with joggers. I love putting them on with jeans and a t-shirt. You can put them over a dress. I mean, you can put these literally over anything. And this is another item that literally adds a nice level of chicness and, you know, just a cute little extra touch to an outfit. Because you can put this on with anything. And I think it makes it look a little bit more chic and you just pull together, right? Um, I love lately, I've been looking at a lot of like the sporty styles. In my opinion, I call it sporty. I'll insert a few pictures of kind of like the look that I mean. But I love how people wear these and they throw them over like joggers and a t-shirt and tennis shoes. And you throw this on. I feel like it just makes you look put together. But anyway, I love these in the fall. I think they're great. You can wear them with anything. And I'm working on having every color. <laughs> I already have camel. I have cream. I have like a forest green. I have red. I have pink. I have houndstooth. Um... Yeah, I have a lot. So I definitely think you need these. I get much wear out of them in the fall. And I think these are essential for every wardrobe because, again, you can throw them over any outfit, literally, and it just instantly adds a level of put together and chic to that um, outfit. All right, babe. So, yes, we're still on outerwear. And, again, we're featuring a lot of outerwear because typically in the fall, the essentials that you need are layering pieces because, um, especially I know here in Texas, during the middle of the day, it gets kind of hot. So you want to have a little bit of layer so that when it gets a little warm, you can take off your jacket or whatever layering piece you have. And then if you're out in the evening and it gets cooler, you can just add your layering piece on top. And then, of course, layering is just cute. So... <laughs> Um, another essential that you'll need is a faux leather jacket. And again, I say faux leather, but if you're into leather, you can do that no matter what you, whatever you want to do. Um, this one is from Charlotte Russe. I've had this one for a couple of years, but my all-time favorite one is from Express. I mean, I guess you guys can tell I genuinely just love Express. But um, yeah, you can find leather jackets literally everywhere from Walmart to Target to H&M to Banana Republic, Nordstrom's, Neiman's, whatever price point you're looking for, you can always find a cute leather jacket. And of course, now they make all different kinds of colors, but I think a classic black one with the silver detailing and hardware is just a staple for all of our wardrobes. I mean, you can throw a moto jacket over literally anything that you have on. Y'all know I love joggers. I've worn them with joggers, jeans, dresses, dress them up, dress them down, doesn't matter. A faux leather jacket or a leather jacket is an essential that you need for the fall. All right, so last but certainly not least, we're gonna talking about our outerwear is a cardigan. Now, I know everyone is not into cardigans, but I genuinely love them because they are soft, cozy, and comfortable. And this is another piece that you can throw on over everything. Now, of course, cardigans are a bit more on the casual side. I don't consider a cardigan, a cardigan to be dressy, but again, in the fall, my dress code is casual, comfy, and cozy. So I love cardigans. You can wear them whether you're lounging around the house, if you work in a cold office, if you go on to run errands, a casual day, whatever have you, a cardigan is the way to go. And they have all different kinds. So you can get more longer dressy cardigans, like the one I shared from Ms. Guy it last a couple of weeks ago that is more of what I would consider like a dressy cardigan um, or you could do one like this which is a bit more casual but it's um, that nice comfy knit material I think these are essential in your wardrobe for the fall because they're so cozy and comfortable and who doesn't want to be cozy and comfortable in the fall all right you guys so I know that I said I had 10 items but I've been trying to do this new thing where I give you guys a wild card because I know everybody might not like it and sometimes I'm on the fence about it too, but I'm all for trying out new things. So I'm personally, in the past, I have not been a fan of denim jackets. I never owned any. I wasn't interested in owning any. It just has not been my vibe. However, lately I've been seeing a few and I've been seeing them styled and I think they're really cute. So I did pick up this one recently from Amazon and I like the pearl detailing on it. That's what made me get it. And y'all, I love this jacket. I love it so much. So I wore it for the first time the other day with um, just some leggings and a shirt and some tennis shoes just to run errands. And 
I just, I literally love this jacket. So I'm adding it as a wild card to the fall wardrobe essentials because if you're like me and you don't like denim jackets, then hey girl, you don't have to have it. However, I think the little cute ones like these, you may want to try out. Now I do love denim jackets and the idea of them to just add again, another layering piece to a more casual outfit. If you're not into like the faux leather and the trench coats, or if you just want something a bit more casual, then a nice denim jacket will take you a long way. And then this is another piece that you can wear outside of the fall, in the spring. You can do denim jackets pretty much year round. Um, but yeah, I love this one with the pearl detailing. And so I just wanted to add this one in the video as a wild card. But let me know in the comments down below if you guys like denim jackets or not. Did you feel the way that I felt about them? I'm just kind of coming around. But it really just depends on what the jacket looks like because a lot of them I don't like. But this one is cute to me. But let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. All right, you guys, so as always, make sure you comment down below. I want to know your thoughts on the denim jacket. And also let me know if I was if there were any fall wardrobe essentials that you feel like are must-haves that I missed. Let me know in the comments down below. And make sure you check out Sheer Text Tights to grab you a pair. I do have a discount code that I'll share here on the screen. And I'll have a link in my discount code in the description box below. Again, I am wearing a size 2X, but again, I just went according to the size chart on the website. So just use that and order your size accordingly, and it'll fit just fine. Thank you so much for watching. As always, I appreciate you more than you know, and I will see you in the next video.